Half of American Jews, according to sur a survey, who said they had an experience that turned them off to Judaism from an institution, blame Hebrew school for that experience. And even though most Orthodox folks don't send their kids to Hebrew school, it has to be a priority. It has to be our number one priority. And we have to couple that with the sense that Hebrew school cannot be seen as the way to subcontract your child or any child's Jewish identity. So it can't be a drop-off point. We have to work to make Hebrew school, to link Hebrew school seamlessly with youth groups, with camping, with trips to Israel, teen trips to Israel, and most importantly to emphasize having Friday night dinner together as a family. In Plank 2, I describe something that isn't, it's a little too complex to go into here, which is a way to dramatically change the way that we finance day school. And it's a program that I call the Equitable Tuition Plan. Because I think that ultimately, day schools are groaning under the weight of the current way that tuition is charged and allocated, and the current mode of scholarship system. 